Now let's consider a situation of loss for a firm which is operating under monopoly. Again my first condition here is find a point where MR equals to MC. This is my MR curve and this is my MC curve. Now where is MR cutting MC at this point? This point is named as E because it becomes my equilibrium point. Thus OQ becomes the equilibrium quantity. Now second step is comparing costs and revenues at point of equilibrium. So at the point of equilibrium I will compare the costs and revenues. From equilibrium I will go up and meet the average revenue curve. I meet the average revenue curve at point B. So BQ is my revenue. Similarly, I'll find my cost from point E. I'll go up and meet the average total cost curve at point A. So AQ is my average cost there. I can see that AQ is, is greater than BQ. Thus I can say my cost is greater than my revenue. And we all know if the cost is greater than revenue, you will have a case of losses which is shown by this rectangle ABPC. We can also present it as ATC being greater than average revenue. So you call it by this that is cost being greater than revenue or average total cost being greater than average revenue. This all means the same thing that the firm is incurring losses because the cost is more than the revenue.